Move it. It's all hands on deck as these doctors, soldiers and police stage the largest evacuation of coronavirus patients since the start of the outbreak in France. They're evacuating fragile patients from regions who have been hard hit by the virus in the east of the country to hospitals in France's western regions. In this hospital in Nancy, eight doctors and nurses are preparing to evacuate two patients in critical condition to a hospital in Bordeaux. C'est les patients qui ont déjà quelques jours d'évolution, hein, là entre 5 et 10 jours, qui ont entre guillemets passé un, une certaine phase aiguë, même si on sait que l'évolution peut être cyclique. Transporting these critically ill patients is not only a cumbersome task for these doctors, but it is also one that is full of risks. Dès qu'on les débranche des respirateurs, on, on perd, on perd tout le bénéfice de la ventilation et ils ont du mal derrière à, à remonter et à récupérer un peu de, de, de capacité pulmonaire. C'est pas, c'est pas sympa. It's a risk authorities are willing to take in an effort to free up intensive care units in the country's worst hit areas. No expense is being spared in these evacuations as emergency workers use specially adapted TGV trains as well as planes to transport patients. France is also looking to its neighbours for a helping hand. Two helicopters were used to evacuate patients over the weekend from Metz in the east of the country to hospitals in Germany.